thought I would make a different kind of morning routine today, something that's more focused on detox and having a morning that, so to speak, fills my cup and things that make me really happy and are a great way to start my day. So these kind of days, I like to push myself, but also be gentle, be productive, but also be lazy. And those kind of mornings always make me the happiest and I wanted to share that with you. I've been focusing more on making time to do things in the morning that set me up for success. Sometimes I do all of these things, sometimes I do none of them, but I'm trying to incorporate at least one or more every single morning. Coffee is the reason I wake up. I think about it right before I go to bed that I get to wake up and drink coffee. I don't know if it's even the coffee that I like that much or just the process of drinking it, but something about it is my favorite ritual ever. Movement is something I need more of in my life and something I so often forget to do or don't make the time to do. It, however, is the biggest change I've noticed in how happy and the amount of energy I have throughout the rest of my day. shower time and I've been working on growing my hair out but actually keeping it healthy this time so I've partnered up with Function of Beauty and I've been using their customizable shampoo and conditioner. It's cruelty free, vegan, and made in the US. All you have to do is take a two minute quiz online and figure out what's most important to you to have in your shampoo and conditioner. My unique formula, I decided to focus on my wavy and thick hair that tends to be a little bit dry so I chose the goals of deep conditioning, fixing split ends, Volumizing, color protection, and anti-frizz. I chose the classic color, but the scent is so amazing. I got it in the heavy scent, which yes, you can choose light, medium, or heavily scented of the eucalyptus, and it's so minty and refreshing. I'm obsessed with using it, but my hair's really taken a liking to it, which makes me think that the customization really works. So if you guys wanna try it out, click the link below to get 20% off your first purchase. It's also currently available in the US, Canada, UK, New Zealand, and Australia. I'm usually a very quick shower, but on days where I'm trying to do a little more self-care, I'll do something like a body scrub. This one's from Costa Rica, handmade there that Ty brought back from me. fit in something fun like a mask in the morning if I have time. I'm using the Mega Greens Galaxy Mask from Glossier just because my skin's been really dry. There's no better way to start your day than with your favorite pair of undies. A really special time for me in the morning is also just disconnecting and sitting having a sip of coffee, and trying my very darndest not to think about anything. Or I like to focus on a word for the day that I wanna focus on. I, it's usually positivity that I'll say to myself over and over again, and I found this changes my mood more than anything. I have three journals I always carry around, one for my feelings. This is where I'll write down gratitude, sadness, happiness, just things I'm thinking about, which today I wrote about not having a meltdown, which is a good thing. And then I have a work and video journal so I can organize video planning, anything like that into one journal so it's separated from my thoughts. And then I overall have my project planner. This is what keeps it all together. So I put in my schedule here. There's little space to set goals for yourself, which I try to do weekly. I kind of break it up into social, home, work, and self goals, which 
I like to set them just to focus on something every single week. Oh, the simple things in life and the simple little tasks that actually make me feel like I did something important even if it's just doing dishes. A weekend type morning and Ty and I always make a point to have a really delicious brunch um, so we make tofu scrambles all the time potatoes just something that makes us really happy and is really filling and we like cooking and eating at home because it just feels good and is relaxing I wanted to add a part about dressing for myself because I think this is one of the biggest things that impacts my mood is feeling like yourself and I think clothes play such a huge role in that. So finding outfits and filling your closet up with things that you really love I think is super important and just focusing on what you want to wear and what feels right that day. Sometimes for me it's jeans and a t-shirt. Sometimes I want to feel really pretty and put on a new dress. Either way, I think taking the time to figure out what you want to wear for the day is actually really important that sometimes I skip and I just throw something on. Also, wear what you want to wear and don't let anyone make you feel weird about it or judged and just put on what feels good for your body.